I told my parents I wanted to go to art and design high school. I remember my eighth grade teacher telling me, don't bother trying to get into the school because you're not good enough. Abstract Expressionism. A lot of people say, what is it? It's a hybrid, respecting graffiti styles and techniques, respecting street art styles and techniques, and abstract expressionism. Being from the South Bronx, the fine art to me was the trains that I've seen, the Hambo courts, the hallways in the project. So that was art to me. We didn't have any outlets back in the day. My outlets were the Hambo courts, alleys, whatever walls I saw I could get away with. Legal walls and murals are just very hard to secure and you also have to be a businessman about it. TAG's Public Arts Project is about encouraging both graffiti and street artists to come together and contribute fine upscale urban art to urban communities. Bronx is the home of hip hop and it's where a lot of the inspiration that made us want to be artists came from. Right now, all the major art gallery shows or exhibits are happening in Manhattan, Brooklyn, Long Island City, or outside of the Bronx. We're bringing it back to the Bronx where it all started. As an artist, you're given a power to do something, and it's really up to you what you do with it. The Bronx is the last refuge. We're always you know, put back. This is public, and people who never really had the opportunity to go out and look at art can get into it, can use art. Will your art withstand the test of time? That's the big question. That's what all artists got to think about.